as we begin this new day, I simply want us to commit ourselves to live for Jesus. It is true that we're going to face many obstacles. There are going to be times where we're going to be alone. There are going to be times when we're angry. But it is our mandate, especially as we start a new year, to live for Jesus. So let us do our best to focus on Jesus and strive to live right, to love right, and to walk right. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, Lord, we come thanking you for this another day that you have bestowed upon us. We ask you, Father, to forgive our sins and to simply create in us a clean heart and to renew a steadfast spirit within us and to restore to us the joy of your salvation as we strive to live for you and to move in excellence. But we ask you, Lord, to touch our minds. Give us clarity of thought as we begin to move and strive to strategize new ways to build the kingdom. We ask you, Lord, to bless those who are struggling on this morning. We ask you to bless those who are hurting on this morning. We ask you to bless those who are in doubt on this morning and let them know that you are in control and you are all powerful. Lord, we ask you to bless our children. We ask you to bless those who are sick and those who are shut in. We ask you to bless the churches, Lord. We know that some of our churches are struggling right now, Lord, but we ask you to encourage your laborers, Lord, and let them know that you've got this and that they can continue to build because you are in charge of the resources. So, Lord, we ask you, Lord, to be with us as we strive to boldly go into this new day. Give us the spirit of love. Give us the spirit of peace. Give us the spirit of grace and mercy, Lord, so that we may be the best that we can be for you, Lord. We ask you to put, put us in remembrance of what you have done. Put us in remembrance of what you have brought us through so we can throw up our hands in praise and give you the honor and give you the glory that you are due. You are a good God. You're an all-sufficient Savior, Lord, and we thank you for loving us in spite of who we are. So right now, Lord, as we prepare to boldly go into this day, give us focus. Give us more love. Give us patience and give us kindness as we do our best to be our best for your glory. So we simply ask you to fall afresh on our hearts on today. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory. Forever we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. And do your best, my brothers and my sisters, to live for Jesus. God bless you.